All right, I just want to do a quick video. Um, I mentioned these batteries uh, probably two, three times too many in my last video, but they're BYD 24 volt. Um, I'm not sure of the amp hours. I think the website said 200 amp hours. Like I said, I don't know. I'll have to look it up. I'm new to all this, but I bought a bunch of these things. Don't know if they're focusing. And I made this. Got this little piece off, jeez, uh, I think it's DigiKey is the name of the website. Uh, and it fits on here perfect. I was just basically testing the pin out. Um, there's a Facebook group, uh, DIY Battery, I believe it's called. And there's a guy, uh, Rich, there has been helping me out a lot. He has a pin out, and um, I just wanted to test it out. Uh, the, the wires are probably overkill. I probably could have just did it with the little pins on here. But uh, anyway, it just helps my process of learning. So uh, everything, everything checked out. The all the um, <clears throat> all the odd cells are on one row, and all the even cells are on the other row. I'd say top or bottom, but I guess that's relative to how you're looking at it or if it's flipped over. But, uh, and the ground wire is also on with the even cells. So basically, uh, it checks out. I have a BMS that's supposed to be for up to a 16S battery. Uh, I believe it's 3.2 volt. Um, and it's like 320 amps. I don't know if I'm going to use it, but it's, it has Bluetooth and it's supposed to work down to an 8S battery, which this is. So I'm going to try and hook it up. Um, cross my fingers, nothing catches on fire, nothing blows up. Um, don't do this at home. Don't come to my channel for uh, any professional advice. I'm a DIY guy. I'm just trying this out. Um, you know, getting help online from guys uh, like Rich and Will Pros, David Paws. All those guys but I uh, just figured I'd make a quick video of me just testing things out honestly I got a new camera I got a new Sony um, a6100 because um, if you saw my last video my other camera my Canon I had an old it's actually my wife's it's a T2i rebel and it only records 1080 for like between two minutes and six minutes before it overheats and shuts down so I guess I need a reason to uh, spend money. But so far I like the camera and I uh, just want to test it out. So. All right, trying to wrap up this video. This took me forever. So I had a BMS, I don't know if you can see it. I think it's in frame. It's um, it's up to a 16S. I bought it for uh, a bunch of batteries I have coming here. They should be here probably next week. Um, I got 16 um, 100 amp hour LiPo batteries that I'm just going to make a big uh, 48 volt battery out of. So I figured I'd use this BMS. But in the meantime, I was, it can work for an 8S. Um, so I hooked it up on here. Finally got the app to work. The app takes forever. I had the wrong app, emailed the eBay guy. He told me the right app, right app, found it. Didn't realize I had to since it's it works for like 16S, 15, 14, 13, 7, 8. You know all these different. You just have the um, just have the different wiring down here. Again, I don't know if you can see this. Um, so once I switched it over to 8S, I start. It started working. It's, the cells were showing the correct um, voltage. 
um, battery hookup. Again, hopefully you can see this. They tested each cell and they kind of wrote them down here. And uh, I'll put some screenshots up, but um, the app the app is actually getting pretty close to these readings. And it's it, I don't know how long it's set since um, Better Hookup took the readings, but because they're a little bit lower. So it's I guess it's to be expected. Like I said, I'm winging this. So it looks like it's working right. It's uh, it's balancing. Let me just I'm just gonna drip bring this down here and I'll show you what it looks like so I don't know if it's focusing but those lights blinking like that mean that it's bouncing so hopefully we'll get everything else you know closer to 3.2 or however whatever this thing's gonna do with it um, again I'm winging it playing it by ear I'm, just amazing questions online. Uh, some more focus. So that's basically it. I got this. This is 24 volts. Oh, before I changed the, uh, when it was still on 16S, but yet hooked up in an 8S, it was only showing um, 20 volts down here at the C minus uh, thing. So I was still getting point to point I was here I was getting 24 25 point whatever volts and down there I was getting 20 as soon as I switched it to 8s 25 it doesn't it doesn't matter so everything looks good it looks like it's bouncing I'll throw some screenshots um, like I said I didn't want this to be a long video uh, I got I ordered two other BMS's that are strictly 8s I don't, I don't think they have Bluetooth I kind of like the Bluetooth but I'll have to see how it works without it um, um, like I said rich Hooked me up with these uh, these little connectors and the pin out. Um, these are just uh, these are temperature um, sensors. So I guess I could you know put them in my hands and heat it up, or maybe uh, put it in some uh, frozen green beans like Will does. So the next step is testing if the low temperature disconnect for charging works. Right now it's charging. So we're gonna take one of these temperature sensors and stick it in a bowl with frozen uh, green beans. Um, but see if it'll cut off. Maybe I will do that. Um, Cause it would be nice to see if it cuts off if it gets down to uh, whatever I have it set. It's probably set at zero. Um, I don't know, that's it. I'm gonna try and keep putting out videos. When I get the other two BMSs, I'll, I'll hook them up, one to each 24 volt battery and then I'm gonna um, make a 48 volt battery by putting two of these in series. Once I do that, I'm gonna take them from here, my workbench, and over to um, an area I'm going to uh, clear up and um, where I'm gonna put my battery, uh, you know, whatever, rack, um, bench, whatever you wanna call it. And uh, the MPPT, I have, I have that. So I'm gonna hook that up. You know, I'm waiting for fuses to come in, uh, battery disconnects to come in, um, some more wiring. Anyway, but I'll, I'm going to do videos as I go along. Uh, if anything, for myself and my five subscribers, which are basically my three kids, my wife and my mother-in-law. I think my brother-in-law and his wife are subscribers too. So uh, it would be nice if you subscribed. Comment. Tell me what I'm doing wrong. I need to know that. Uh, I'm probably doing a bunch of stuff wrong. But uh, just let me know what you think. I'm going to keep putting videos out just because I want to get better. Um, I'm sure you're rolling your eyes saying this, this guy's this guy's not that great, but I, I hope to get better. And uh, yeah, that's that. I, again, got a new camera. I put a new lens on too. This is the lens that came with it, uh, the kit lens they call it. So I just want to see how that worked out. I want to see how autofocus is working. I, I don't know if that's focusing or what, but uh, we'll find out. So thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, or don't. Um, I wish you would, though. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. See ya.